this is my work vehicle. It's a 13 year old minivan and well, it's not the greatest, but at least it's somewhat decent. And I use it to go out to do all my commissions and to do all my private painting. And it always has to carry all my stuff. The problem with it though is it doesn't have any designated room for all my supplies, nor for my paint. All this stuff is just flying around in my trunk, which is horrible. So I'm gonna build something rudimental, but functional for this car. And before we can start doing that, we're gonna to have to make a plan. You see, I like to use these Euro boxes. I think that's what they're called, because they fit my cans quite perfectly. What I don't like though is that they are everywhere. I need a specific spot for them where I can reach all of them and they're always ready to go. And I think the best way to do that is building some sort of platform up here that would hold all my painting boxes and then on the lower level below the platform that'll be where all my supplies are. I'm talking caps, uh, tape, cleaning supplies, all the kind of stuff you would need. And then what I also need is a spot for my ladder here which is this thing. Maybe I can put the ladder somewhere here behind the seats and then let the platform end here. I don't know, have to figure that out. All right, back at the storage. Um, I'm gonna clean out the entire trunk right now so we can properly measure the dimensions and then head to the hardware store to get all the lumber for the new build. So I'm on my way to the outdoor store right now to get lumber and I'm gonna get what I think might fit and then once I start building I might have to go back and get more but well let's see how that goes. All right, got the lumber. No idea if that's enough, but I guess we'll figure that out very soon. getting dark I'm gonna finish that tomorrow all right day number two let's finish it up okay so pretty much done with the bottom part of the construction next step is cutting and installing the top level
Okay, that should fit now. Push it over here. Sweet. That's all I wanted. Car conversion is done. I think it looks way better than before. And even more importantly, it is super functional right now. Everything that I need to do my commission work has its own spot from now on. The way I set the thing up now is I basically have three shelves. The bottom shelf, because it's a little bit uneven, um, is actually perfect to fit my ladder which is a little bit wider on the bottom a little bit thinner up top so it perfectly slides in there the second shelf is where i have all my supplies this is where my tape is where my brushes are and my markers and it's just tools and little bits and pieces that i need to do my work the top shelf holds all my paint it easily fits six of my euro boxes which is more than enough to bring for any commission that i go on I also have a little bit of extra room up here, which comes in handy because whenever I'm able to park close to wherever I paint, I have a little bit of a desk for my, for my cans. So I can just place them here or even just use this like as a countertop to use my stove and make a coffee or sometimes I need to cut stencils on the fly. This is a pretty good spot for that. And right behind the driver's seat, I've got a little bit of extra room, which is ideal to put like a little bit of carpet or drop cloth or I'm gonna put my foldable pushing cart in there. And all my Euro boxes up top are secured with a little bit of bungee cord. So there's nothing flying around anymore. I'm super happy with how this entire thing turned out. Now, is this the most beautiful thing I've ever built? Most certainly not. But is it functional? Heck yeah. Does it make my life so much easier? Absolutely. What would I do differently if I did it again? Um, I would probably use a little bit thinner um, plywood for the shelves. It's pretty thick and I think I loaded a lot more weight into my trunk than I needed to, but that's all right. I mean, you learn as you go. If you want to build something like that, maybe that was a little bit of a help how to do that. Uh, yeah, and I hope this video inspires you to Make the most out of what you have. Okay, if you liked that video, I would really appreciate if you click the like button, maybe leave a comment, I always read them, I always reply to them, and maybe even subscribe if you like the videos I'm putting out. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Bye.